long-winded. Uh, I discovered this method back in 2013. And uh, uh, for those of you that are, are joining us or are new to, to internet marketing, uh, new to video marketing, uh, my name is Anthony Aries, and I've been doing video marketing since 2008. Um, and I discovered the method that we're going to show you here tonight in its infancy, in its infancy at 2013. I was really only scratching the surface when I discovered it back then. And uh, what had happened was Google had had a very big algorithm update called the, uh, the, the Penguin update. Has everyone heard of the Penguin update? I'm curious, who in here has heard about the, the, the algorithm update called the Penguin update? Real quick, I just want to have an idea of, of the kinds of folks that we have in our audience. We have a lot of people here today. Uh, just, just give me a one if you've heard of the, the Penguin update. And give me a two if you haven't. I'm just curious to see. Okay, lots of yeses. Because that update is what caused me to come up with this idea. Yes. Okay, so it seems like you all kind of have a good understanding of the Penguin update. So what happened was Google penalized websites that were getting a lot of backlinks that the, the anchor text was not randomized or diversified and people were building backlinks to the very to, to only one URL that was part of it or the anchor text backlinks were the same like people were using you know keyword one as an example they were using it you know a thousand times to get backlinks with that keyword so those sites got penalized well I had the idea of I figured out that you could I could create five YouTube URLs um, and they all went back to the same video, okay? And uh, so I started, instead of building backlinks to one YouTube video, I started building backlinks to all five. Well, I ended up teaching this method inside my flagship training. Uh, it's called the Speed Ranking System. And a couple of my students picked up on this, and they're like, Anthony, I don't think you realize what you've discovered here. This is bigger than what you're teaching us. And they went and found 22 different YouTube URLs. And we're going to show you here tonight. And so they basically took what I taught them and brought it to the next level. And this is why it's awesome when you have an abundant mindset and you share with people. They can, there are people that can take what you have had an idea and taken it to the next level. And that's what, that's what my students did. Uh, two guys by the name of Gil and Damon. Well, on the call here tonight, I got Damon. Um, Damon's from Dallas, Texas. Super cool guy. Damon, say hello to everyone. Howdy. How are y'all doing tonight? And we're getting lots of greats and wonderfuls. Awesome. Excellent. Okay, so what we're going to do is if y'all are ready to go, let's rock and roll because we just want to be quick about it. I don't want to take up three hours of your time here all night. I say we get cracking. Let's show you what we got. You're going to learn something here tonight. Um... Uh, we're going to teach you, actually teach you how to do this method, okay? Um, you can do this manually. We're going to teach you how to do it manually. And then if you're interested in saving up to six hours of your time, we're going to show you a pretty cool whiz-bang piece of uh, software that we created that, <laughs> that uh, takes those six hours of time that it would take you to do uh, the, all 12 steps of the method uh, manually and do it in 60 seconds. So we're going to show you that too. But either way, you're going to learn. We're going to give you a spreadsheet that's going to have all the steps. And uh, you, you, you can take this spreadsheet at the end and you can go do this and, and rank some videos because it works like gangbusters. And you can rank them on YouTube and Google. That's how powerful it is, not just uh, Google. Most people are out there just teaching you how to rank on Google. So uh, I'm going to let Damon get cracking if you all are ready to go. We're getting lots of I'm messages. excited tonight. This is a... This is a fun thing for me to show. Um, it's how to rank videos on page one of Google without having to buy views, build complicated backlinks, embed videos, write press release, like, or comments to your video. This is a powerful tool that we're using, and I can't wait to show you. I'm also going to show you how to do this in 60 seconds or less with real-life case studies. And just for instance, what I'm going to do, you'll see a lot of screenshots. Uh, this is from some of our customers, 
and this was corporate and promotional video in Portsmouth. Uh, he ranked it in 29 minutes on page one of Google. Uh, this took 12 hours, but it's Fort Worth YouTube Video Marketing. This was actually one of my clients that I did some work for, uh, and we got it up on, it took uh, close to 12 hours. Valerie, she's one of our clients, and she, she actually got two rankings up on page one of Google. One, it took her about 52 minutes, and one was about three hours. This is another one of our clients. They did uh, Empire Presenter. This was a launch that's actually, it, it came out, I think, early June. Uh, and so it had 1.1 million results, search results, and we were the second page on Google. This one is Leads to Profit Formula, and we ranked uh, one, number one position for 64 million search results in about 13 minutes. Would you like to get these benefits, these results like these? If you would, just go ahead and give me a one saying yes. <laughs> uh, this is for you if you want to get on the first page of Google and generate traffic to your website, videos, affiliate offers, local clients, and more without getting overwhelmed by tech. We, we have a philosophy, three clicks and you're done. And so that's our software is made and designed so you could be three clicks, less than 60 seconds, and you're completely done. You've got that video uh, on, the, on the way to being ranked. I'd say a serial entrepreneur, a product creator, an internet marketer, and a video speed wrecker. I learned a lot of SEO and video marketing from Anthony, and we've just taken it to a new level, and we've automated the system. Uh, they call me a slow-talking Texan. Uh, I think I talk fairly fast, but uh, you could actually speed me up a little bit sometimes on YouTube and actually uh, get me talking fast there. However, I'm, I'm here to show you today some of the fastest video ranking strategies online today. And I want to show you step by step how you can do it too. Here's what you'll learn today. The secret YouTube didn't want you to know. Turning one video into 22 unique variations in about 50, 49 seconds there. Uh, why is this important? When the Penguin Cup update came out, the, the Penguin update was primarily about sending a bunch of backlinks to a single URL, to a single YouTube video or to a single web page. And what our system does is it creates 22 unique variations. We're actually adding variations on a weekly basis to this. Uh, so you're sending backlinks not to one video URL, but to 22 different URL variations. And all these variations, they all point to one video. How to trick Google into giving you page one rankings. What Google is looking for is they're looking for popular videos or popular websites to rank. And so they're looking at all the social signals out there. So we're going to show you how to do that. I'm assuming you already know it's easier to rank a video on page one of Google than it is a website. The reason is, is Google bought YouTube. Back in November 2006, they paid $1.65 billion for YouTube. Since then, they have just increased YouTube so where it is the second most searched uh, the URL in the world, and it's the second largest search engine. And they like putting their own videos on the first page of Google because you never leave. And they keep displaying ads to you on YouTube. Google is making money both on AdWords and on ads they have on YouTube. So it's they're incentivized to keep videos that are popular based on all the social signals and, and views to keep it on page one of Google so they can make more ad revenue. There's so many different roadmaps on how to do it. We're going to show you a very powerful, yet it's relatively unknown method of how, we, how we're doing this. The method gets you on page one of Google without having to buy the views, the, the complicated backlinks, the embedded videos, press releases, my likes, or even comments to your video. So what I'm about to do is I'm about to show you how to do it the old-fashioned way. Now, I say old-fashioned. It just means it's the manual method. Uh, Anthony, did you want to 
say something here. I'm... Uh, yeah, or, uh, uh, can we pull up that uh, that spreadsheet, or we could start talking about yeah. it as you pull up the spreadsheet. A lot Let's of folks, that. yeah, a lot of folks. Um, first of all, uh, does everyone follow in what we're what we're talking about here with these different YouTube URLs? I want to see if y'all understand what we're talking about. Uh, some people are advanced, and some people aren't in our, in our on our audience today, and so. What I'd like to do is kind of like uh, just figure out where folks are at so that we can kind of get everyone on the same page. Let me know. Give me a one if you understand, a two if you're confused. And is anybody out there? All right. There we go. It must be delayed. Maybe GoTo is a little delayed today. So all right, so it seems like everyone is understanding where we're coming from. All right, because oh, we got we got we got uh, a couple of twos coming in now. Okay, all right. So so essentially, what we've got here is we've got this spreadsheet with all of the different YouTube URLs. Okay, and what we're gonna do uh, is Damon is gonna go uh, grab a video off of YouTube. Uh, so let's just do that really quick. And every video on YouTube has its own video code. And so we're going to basically grab that video code. Now let's just pretend this is our video, right? Just, just for the sake yeah. of argument. We're going to pretend. I'm just going to grab this one. Okay. Okay. Jimmy Fallon. Yep. Here we go. That right there is your video code. Yep. Slow down just a little bit so everybody can catch up to me. What I did was I just copied that code. And I went over, I'm going back over to the spreadsheet. Yep. And where it says video code, as I'm going to replace that video code. And the way I do that, I, I hit Control F, go over to replace, and I'm going to replace, replace it with the new code. And I'm going to replace the word video code. So we yep. did 22 replacements. So all 22 of those URLs go back to that Jimmy Fallon video, and, and, and we'll have Damon pull up a couple of them so you can see what happens when he pastes them into new tabs. Okay, there's one. And I'll just grab an odd one right here. How's that one? I'll come up and paste it again. Okay. And I'll grab one here. That looks like Tom Cruise in the background. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and let's just grab one more and just grab that one. So you can kind of see where all this is going. And so what everybody does, this is what 99% of your competition is doing. 99% of your competition is going to that default YouTube URL, which is this one right here. This is the default one. Everybody goes and builds backlinks to this URL. Okay? You all understand building backlinks is, is important to getting on the first page of Google and YouTube. People go and build backlinks to those URLs, right? So what we're doing is we're going to get all 22 URLs and we're going to build backlinks to each one of them. And as you can see, here's all the variations that are currently approved by YouTube. And all this is uh, actually in YouTube's API. And you see all these shortened variations and lengthened. And there's even embedded videos in here. Uh, so what we would do is I actually have a set of instructions. And you'll get this spreadsheet, <coughs> this spreadsheet at the end. Uh, we find the video URL, and then we copy it and replace the video code. We also grab the playlist code and the channel code and the user code and we'll put them in. And we'll replace all those variations. And I, let me hop back over here. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Down here is the channel code and here's the user code and here's the playlist code. And I'm going to hop over just to show you how we would grab the channel just as an example. And make sure it's not playing. See, it says channel right here. That's the channel code. 
and there's a way to grab the user code and the playlist code. I'll just that's the channel code. I'll grab the playlist code just to show you. And I'll just pick one right here. And that's the long playlist code. So you would have to grab each of those plus the user code. And we come back here and you would replace them here, here, and here. So now you have 25 URLs that are ready to do something with. Then what we do is we create an RSS feed from this list of YouTube variations. And I've got a resource over here, uh, feed creators. And what I'll do is I'll just I'll pull this one up just so to show you how you how we would do it. And I would go back to my go back to my spreadsheet here. I would grab that list of variations, and it don't. Actually, this free version only takes 20, so I'm just going to grab the 20 here. And I'll hop back over there. And you would paste that there. And I'll just bring in here and create a simple RSS. And that's all this is. Now, this is a very simple RSS feed. It doesn't even put a title or a description or a thumbnail. But each of these links takes you back over to the links. So all of them are the different YouTube variations that we just created inside the RSS feed. Uh, make sure to save this for later, Damon, so we can show the difference of what we do versus this. Oh, yeah. Awesome. So I'll just jump out of that. Awesome. Is and everybody getting this? I just want to make sure everyone's getting this. Could you all give us some ones? Let us know that you're getting this. Awesome. Rob gets it. Got a lot of ones. Larry gets in. it. Robert gets it. Gary gets it. Megan gets it. Todd gets it. Janet. Brett. Uno. I like that, Brett. <laughs> he said, Uno. <laughs> All right, great. Cool. So we're good. We're good. Let's get back on track then, Damon. Okay. So we've created the RSS feed. Now, what we would do is we would go to Google variations and bitly variations and we would plug that RSS into each of these shorteners. Then we would go to feed burner. Now this takes a little bit of time going into feed burner setting everything up and we would put all those variations that we copied right here. In fact I would even copy the channel and the RSS the user in the playlist. So I would actually have 25 variations plus my two shorteners. And I would create a feed burner. And then I would go out and create a shortener for the feed burner and a bit.ly for the feed burner. Then I would take all these URLs that we have just created and I would ping them all out, including the RSS feeds and the shortened links. Then I'll go out and I'll index them and create backlinks with all the variations, including the RSS feeds and the short, shortened links. And we use a link processor. We have an agency account that will send them all through, but you can use any other backlinking service that you want. And I just want to kind of point out to you is from here to here, step one to step 11 is all done on VidPenguin. It, take, it takes me, and I know what I'm doing, about 94 minutes to go through. I, I time myself, the little stopwatch, just to know how long it took for one single video. So this works. If you don't if you want to do this manually, this is the, the, the setup instructions that I did for a long time manually. And I just happened to run into a coder and told them what I was doing. And the coder said, oh, I can automate that, take a, a few weeks, and uh, we can do all this in about 60 seconds. Well, it didn't take a few weeks. It took a few months. And we went through beta testing. And we, we hammered this so hard with all types of channels. You, uh, playlists, uh, YouTube variations, and we got it working and it's a solid platform. But this is the way I did it manually and this still works. It's the exact same steps that we use to automate it. Uh, but then we took it one step further. We built bookmarks and video embeds with the different titles and descriptions for each variation and we submitted it to all the social media services. This took about six hours. I paid a Fiverr gig, I had a virtual assistant doing it, and I did it a few times 
just to see how long it actually takes. And it is a pain in the butt. It took about uh, six hours to do all, uh, actually about four hours to do all this. But uh, adding all this up, it takes about almost five and a half hours to do one single video. Let me say that again. One single video <laughs> takes about five and a half hours. It's crazy. It's crazy. So anyway, at the end of this uh, webinar, uh, you know what's crazy, everybody on this call. Well, I don't I, I mean to interrupt you. I just I was inspired. Huh? This is how I used to do it. <laughs> I used to spend this much time on every single video campaign. Now imagine spending that much time on a video and it's a product that doesn't convert. Has that ever happened to you? Let me know if that's happened to you. Would that suck? Have you ever spent that much time ranking a video? You get it on the first page and it doesn't convert. Let me know one if that's happened to you. I'm just curious because I, I feel your pain. Yep, lots of ones. Exactly. It's frustrating, right? How about if you were to hire someone for four bucks an hour to do this task? How much would it cost you? Twenty bucks to the first person that tells me how much it would cost to have someone uh, do this for four bucks an hour. Up, oh, Megan wins. Twenty bucks. She was fast. Uh, it would cost you. It would cost you about. about uh, it would cost you twenty-five bucks to to do it. So think about that. Every time you do a video, it's going to cost you 25 bucks to do it if you outsource it. Does everyone see how crazy that is? Like how much of a pain that is? Well, and Anthony, not to mention, you would have to train your outsourcer. You would have to spend the time, those six hours, going step by step explaining everything on how to do it yourself. So to get the first couple of videos, it may cost you another 20 to 30 hours plus their time in addition to it. Correct. Correct. Does everybody see that? Can I get some ones? I want to make sure everybody can see that. This is a tried and true formula for ranking. Uh, this past week, I did some crazy, um, I did some crazy case studies where out of like 17 videos that I tried to rank for, there were roofing videos too, local roofing niche. I was able to rank for over half of the videos uh, that I uh, went and uh, and tried to get on the first page with using this method. So it's super powerful. Um, but uh, if y'all want to, I can show you uh, as a little bonus at the end. If you're interested, let me know if you're interested. I can show you all those videos. They're all ranking on Google. We can go through every one of them live on Google. If that's something you're interested in, in, in seeing, give me a one, and I can show you that as a little bonus at the end. Oh, yeah, lots but of I, ones. I wonder, excellent, excellent. I want to point out one thing is I highlighted this number, and I want you to keep this in mind as we get near the end when we talk about predictive ranking uh, strategy that we have. 94 minutes. We are going to show you how to do something in 94 minutes that will almost – in fact, it won't take you 94 minutes. It may take you 94 seconds to get there. But we're going to reduce this time so you can actually predict ahead of time where your video is going to rank and how fast it will will rank. This is like no other strategy you've ever learned. And I just want to point out, it takes 94 minutes to do it the manual way. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump back into the presentation. Do you have any more on this, Anthony? Uh, no, I'm good. Okay. Now, how about we show you both the best and by far what well, what I feel like is the easiest way in just 60 seconds to do this. Okay, I'm going to crank up my vid penguin and let me do this. Okay, when you crank up VidPenguin, the first screen you'll ever see is, is a couple of videos here just getting started. And all you have to do is hit ping, and that's all we need to do to get started. So I'm going to hit ping. Now I want you to watch me. I'm going to go grab me a video, and we've already looked at Jimmy there, so let's just go back up to home, and we'll grab some other video in here. 
um, we'll pull George straight here. So I'm going to grab that video straight from up there, uh, and this is the UR browser bar, and I'm going back to my finger. Okay, it confirmed it's Baby Blue by George Strait. I'm going to go to Variations, and here's a slider bar. Now, you can go from 0 to 22 variations, and we teach you in our courses, sometimes you don't want all 22 because you're just going to tweak a video. You're just going to push it up a little bit. But in our case, we want to go 22 variations across. And you can either check off or check on whether you want to use the shorteners. And that's, that's the title with it. Now, we even have the ability, we have a spin tax reader in here where you can actually vary this up if you want to do that. Now, I don't want to get too complicated with this, but this is about all you have to do for spin tax. I just copied a few of them, and you close it, and I'll take out George Strait here. And sometimes people actually, believe it or not, misspell George Strait. So I'll just uh, I'll misspell his name. And then I'll come over here, greatest. And these are just words that you might want to use just to vary it up a little bit. Now, what I'm also going to do is I'm going to just copy this down. Just I want to just show you what it looks like. Okay, so I've done some spin varia. You don't have to do this at all. I do this because I want to rank on different titles, different descriptions, and maybe multiple keywords. So I hit preview. And I'm looking at them, and you can see things are starting to change right here. Titles, descriptions. You can see everything changed. That's just baby blue. And you get the thumbnail there. And guess what? You are ready to go. Now, before you do that, you might actually want to label your feed burner. And you can change this to, I'm just going to put George Strait down here. And I'm going to hit Save and Ping. Now what this is doing is it's going out and it's creating the two feed burners. And it's submitting them through uh, our indexing system. Now it looks like it didn't go through feed burner, but that's okay if it doesn't go. It's submitted to the internal. So I'm going back over to Dashboard. I'll show you what happens if it, if it fails at that one time. Uh, come back here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to push it back through the indexer. And that's the way it looks right there. Let's show them um, what it looked like when you tried to make the uh, feed on one of those free RSS creators. Look at the difference, folks, of the feed. So this is the feed that we created on uh, with one of those free RSS creators. Check out the feed that we created with VidPenguin. Uh, and you can uh, you can also go back to and redo the feed burner by just uh, selecting there, and then clicking that red uh, toggle, and oh, you can yeah. resend it to feed burner. Does anyone here know who owns feed burner? Anybody here know who owns feed burner? Google. That's right. All right. <laughs> Let me show you what a feed burner feed looks like. So check it out. We're hosting these videos on a Google property. We're putting these videos on a Google property. Does anybody see the importance of using Google to spread the word? <laughs> this is one of the greatest inventions that I've ever uh, learned from Anthony is feed burner if you put your RSS feed burner in, you ha you stand a very good chance that Google's going to pick it up exactly the same day that you actually post it. Yep. And you can see this is how good looking it looks. Now this is I haven't done very much at all to the description. I haven't and I very barely changed the title. But imagine if you had different titles, different descriptions, but they all pointed back to the exact same video. Now I'm going to go back to the video and make sure it's working. Okay. 
uh, anyway, I don't want to go through the ad there, but that that's one. Uh, I'll just pick another one. And there's that's actually the big video embed page. And I'll pick another one. Now this is coming straight out of this is coming straight out of Google's own property. It's out of their feed burner account. And again, uh, I want to point out this is what it looked like before, and this is what it looks like after. Now, even if you go before right here, there's only about maybe 1% of any SEO people out there doing videos that will actually create an RSS feed. Yep. Now what we're doing is we're creating two feeds. We're creating an internal feed, and we're creating a, that's the internal, and then that's the feed burner. Okay, now I'm going to go back here. What we've done is we've created a list of URLs. If you want to see what the list is, you've got it right there. And you can do anything you want with this list. You can copy it. Uh, copy it, I hit Control A and then Control C and I copy it. And I can actually go out and paste it on any other link indexing service, any pinger. I can create another RSS feed if I want to do something like that. Uh, there's so many options that you can do. You could send it to Fiverr, and they could be, build link wheels off of it. Uh, or there's one-hour backlinking service that does, has some very high page rank, and they'll take all these, and they'll backlink them through all their uh, high page rank uh, blog properties. Or you could send it to a private blogger network. That's where the real power comes in is when you're working with this feed list, you're going to a private blogger network, or you're going to LinkWheel, or you're going to any of these powerful backlinking services. But we don't we don't really stop right there. We have built in to this two more properties that we integrate with: uh, Backlinks Indexer and Sinwire. Uh, give us a one if you've ever heard of Sinwire, or if you're even using Sinwire. Looks like Robert's using Sinwire. He's heard of it. There's Don. And let me show you what Backlinks Indexer is. And I'll show you how easy it is. You basically click on it, and it's all ready to go. You just hit Submit. And I just submitted to Backlinks Indexer, which is one of the number one indexing services online today. So it really did take about one click here and one click to submit. Sinwire, this is, we just added this integration about 30 days ago, and I haven't even experienced everything that you can do with it. Uh, you could choose your campaigns. I have a whole bunch of campaigns, and let's just say I want to do, I have a team of minions working for me, and I'm going to do some status updates, and you can even drip feed it. Let's say I want to drip feed it over seven days. And then you hit send all included variations. So it's going to send all 22 variations, and it's going to send the RSS feed, and it's going to send uh, the shortener links there. So that's basically all you would do to activate Sinwire. Now, if you've ever used Sinwire, it's a little bit more complicated than just hitting a green button. Um, but it's, it's, Sinwire is fairly easy to use. But this just streamlines it for you. You don't even have to hop into Sinwire. So it saves you about another 10, 15 minutes of just being able to hit that big green button. So that's the demonstration. Uh, Anthony, I, I think I may even point out MASH beta. This is a, bash, uh, a beta, but this is an RSS uh, masher uh, that we, we're adding in. We're just we're testing it out right now, so it's it's not a full-blown package, but what we do is we tend to test products inside of VidPenguin. You get to use them for free while they're in beta, and you get to play with them, uh, do anything that you want with them. Uh, I'm not going to actually go into the masher right now because it, it takes a few more clicks. It's about five clicks to go through it, but the ping, this is what you're purchasing if you decide you want to join us today with VidPenguin. This entire ping system, you saw how easy it was. We have, we have a complete training and bonus, and I'll just kept go into it just to kind of show you what it looks like. And once you joined, you'll be able to 
get this entire program. Now we have basic training, we have our coaching calls, we have webinar replays, we have bonuses, we have a lot of bonuses. I'll just click on that. Uh, video marketing, cinemar tips, leasing assets, uh, loophole secrets, local city multiplier that we're loading up this weekend, uh, check a tractor. We even go in and talk about animation, uh, domination. It's a, a little video production training. And we have some other tools recommended by our Bid Penguin members. That, and this is just the bonus section. The basic training is we go into fundamentals. Uh, we have a uh, fundamentals has a lot of videos in it. Well, there's just three on that one. I think it's the, the next one here. Yeah, case studies. We've got a couple. Uh, we've got a lot of case studies in there. But then I do one-on-one. -on -one. This is actually where I will step you for, through the entire ranking process. I think we've got about 12 or 13 videos in here. Yeah, we got a few videos in here. And you can see these are all the different steps, and we will walk you through step by step on how to do it. And then we have our webinar replays in here. These are webinars that we've recorded in the past, so you can kind of you're not starting from scratch. You are you have a platform that you can go back to. In addition to our our one of the most active Facebook groups right now is our Vid Penguin group. And I'm going to hop back into our PowerPoint here. Okay, that's a, what we call the easy button. It's using Bid Penguin. Um, here's the link if you're wanting to check us out. Uh, it's vidpenguin.com slash tubejeet. And we have all, a lot of proof in there. We have a, a lot of social testimonials from our members. Okay, uh, let's keep on going here. Okay, this is really just for the first 40 folks that sign up today. We're going to we're trying to maintain a very stable platform as we bring people on, so we can only really take about 40 people in off this webinar. And it looks like we have a lot more than that on the webinar right now. Uh, there's no confusion. There's no thought to it. There's no installation. This is run on the cloud. You don't. You can run it on a PC, a Mac, an iPad. I haven't tried a phone yet, but I think it works on just about anything. You just log in, push the button, and go. When you do, you'll be on the fast track to page one of rankings. Now, is every single video going to rank within 60 seconds? Probably not. They do take time, and it's and we can't tell Google how fast to rank it. I wish we could. It'd make it my life a lot easier. Uh, this is a complete new software technology and training that it, it really simplifies your life and it takes six hours worth of work and squeezes it down to about 60 seconds. And you get to look over my shoulder as I take you hand, by the hand I'll show you exactly how we rank videos and how we make money in a complete case study. Um, in addition to the training we have a lot of local marketing videos about how you can actually make money, how you can negotiate with local vendors, how you can go in and show them what you're going to be doing, not only to their their company name website, but local niches. And we talk about affiliate marketing, we talk about launch jacking. These are different ways that you can make money just by ranking a video on page one of Google. You're going to get the exact software training and expert guidance that we've given a lot of our uh, clients so far with showing them step by step how to do everything. You're going to be part of the one of the most active Facebook support groups online today. And I say that and people think, well, you're just joking about this. I'm, I'm serious. We've actually ha had to hire somebody just to sit on Facebook that, to help us out. And Bill Marks, you'll see a lot of him in there. Uh, Bill went through our course. We took him through a black hat strategy course. We took him through some expert mastermind courses just to get him trained enough to help us step by step help you get your videos on page one of Google. And if as a workshop bonus today for the 2G uh, customers, we're going to throw in our video marketing 101. It's got a PDF guidebook and a cheat sheet. We also have a toolkit training on the five best tools for video marketing. Uh, we I went in and I, I 
I'm a big Sinbar user, and I put in the 10 best content syndication power user strategies. What this is, is how do you use Sinwire and maximize it to the fullest? Uh, we have the Houdini magic ranking trick. This is actually, I'm, I'm hoping Gil loads it up this afternoon, but it's the local city multiplier. This is how you can take one local video for, let's say, a plumber. And I, I live in Dallas, so I'll use plumber in Dallas. And how you can multiply that, that plumbing video in Dallas to be Fort Worth, Grand Prairie, Arlington, all the surrounding cities of Dallas without ever creating a single, uh, without creating any other video besides just a single video. And we do that inside of VidPigler. We have the check attractor system. This is a local business silent salesman. We teach you how to create your video that you actually get calls from the client before you even pick up the phone and do a cold call. Animation domination. This is a fun video training. We haven't even put this on uh, recorded yet. We're still building a lot of the slides that go in with this. This is so much fun. I, I enjoy animation. Um, and I'm going to go in step by step what's the best tools to use, how you use them, and how you incorporate it into your money making videos. And we have a lot more. We have a lot of clients uh, or a lot of customers in our system that have actually taken our system and they've multiplied it with other uh, integrations. And it's kind of exciting to see some people really take hold of video ranking and we have fun doing it at the same time. And the ultimate bonus, what I feel like is our coaching calls. This is where you're going to get to ask me and Gil, Gil and I, uh, we're going to brainstorm solutions to your problems. And what we do is we automate and we simplify solutions. Uh, that's where Gil and I work the best is anything that we see that is a manual method for doing anything, we will simplify it. Uh, we do it for video ranking. We're doing it for RSS mashups. We're all doing it for keyword probing, and we'll get into that in the bonus section there. Uh, so, again, this is just some... Examples. This is one of my clients over in uh, London. And instead of focusing straight on London, he's actually working on uh, South, uh, on Kingston, uh, Surrey, South London, Southwest London. And he placed three videos just on one, uh, Surrey, which is just outside of London, for video marketing. And he's picking up clients that want to do video marketing. Uh, this is a book review. This was uh, fairly easy to do, a book review on Amazon. Uh, this is a software course called Garage Sale Marketing. And if you'll notice, I got five videos for the same keyword. I did this about six months ago, and I actually did this the manual method before we even had the software. Just to show you, it does work manually. This is one I actually did manual too. Uh, the software didn't actually come out until about uh, mid-March. So I wanted to show everybody that you can do it manually or you can do it the automatic easy way. So if you want to see your videos on page one of Google with just three clicks in just 60 seconds, this software is specifically for you. So what I say is get BitPenguin now. Uh, it's the only video ranking software that gets page one rankings with just 60 seconds or less of work. I'll go, I think we've already seen that Valerie slide there. Uh, this is another, this is a, a blueprint book review. Uh, this was done and it took about 24 hours to get that one up. This is Screencast Pro Review. So if you want to do some affiliate uh, marketing or launch jacking, this is a great software to have. You do a quick review of the product, and then you throw it into BitPenguin. Uh, this is 16 minutes to page one. This is one of my local clients. Uh, it's a bookstore in downtown Dallas, and it's a coffee shop. I actually get free cookies and free coffee now because I ranked his video on page one of Google for bookstores. This is just what some of our current customers are saying about our product. Like Mike Mallory, hey Damon and Gil, first off, thanks guys for doing it. It's certainly appreciated. 
Uh, Peter Ball, he's very impressed. Yule Hiltman, you'll see him. He's always in, in Facebook. Great stuff. Thanks for implementing. So you want to be the first 40 to sign up. If you can't, you can still enroll for the prize public page. You won't get it all the workshop bonuses. So you want to be in this first 40 this evening. So don't ask me if after the first 40 are sold out. I, I can't give you any more. That's all that our platform can take on tonight. You've watched this entire presentation. I know you want free targeted traffic that sells your stuff. This is the neat thing about video ranking is once you get the video ranked, you may have to come in once a month, twice a month, and do a few little tips and uh, techniques to keep it up on one. And we show you what, what to do. Uh, but you don't have to do a lot of work to keep that ranking in place. Here's some more testimonials. Paul Collins, he's one of our really active uh, rankers. Uh, this is, it uh, looks like Sherman, uh, best video ranking tools. Out of 52 million results, we are number one right here. And it took about 43 minutes to do. And that's actually one of our own videos. Click, pop, engage. Uh, it took us four minutes, 11 million search results for click, pop, engage. Here's another book review. Here's another uh, software review. This is Social Leads Machine. This is one of the uh, products that was released earlier this year. And I actually ranked, uh, this is 12, 4, 14. So this was prior to uh, the Vid Penguin software using the exact techniques that we taught you in the manual method. You know this is an excellent value, and you want to take advantage of this deal today. So go ahead and go to vidpenguin.com slash tube and why are we doing this? We're doing it because I like working with people. In fact, I'm a leader of a large, one of the largest cycling groups in the state of Texas. It's Dallas Cycling Trail Riders. And I like working with people. I like talking to people. I like coaching. In addition, Gil's the same way. And Anthony will pop in on our group and share some of his wisdom, not only of, of how to write videos, but what do you do to make money once you have the videos ranked? So we did promise a spreadsheet. And if, if you'll type in right here, uh, that is the spreadsheet link. Let's see if I can grab it here and I'll post it back in there for you. I'm going to paste this in the chat box here. Anthony, I don't know if I can actually paste that in myself. It looks like I'm locked out of it. Uh, I can do that for you. I will take care of that. Okay, no, here no we go. Problem. I'll get that. I think I got it in there. Okay. If not, I just sent it to yep, Brad it. Scott. <laughs> oh, nope, you did it. I'll get it in there. Okay. Okay. Um, anybody have any questions right now that we can answer, I guess, on a public forum here. I don't, uh, uh, I, guess. I don't, uh, one of the things that um, seems to be coming up is, uh, can I use this without SendWire and Backlinks Indexer? Absolutely you can. Yes. Uh, I, I can show you all really quick. Let me show you all really quick. I did 17. Um, I did 17 um, case study rankings uh, this past uh, this past weekend. I did it over the weekend, and because of Video Penguin, I was able to do what I call it's called keyword probing. And um, I'm going to open all of these so that you can take a look at it. Um, what this allows me to do is to find out if it's really easy for me to rank for a keyword without having to go and build the video and you know I don't want to put all this work into 
having an awesome video made if, if it's going to be a hard keyword to rank for. I'm, I've made a fortune going after low-hanging fruit. While everyone else, my competition, is trying to go after really hard keywords, I spend my days finding really easy keywords to rank for. And then once I find out an easy keyword to rank for, I go and get a professional video made and then I go and pop it in there. Okay? So because of VidPenguin, I was able to do all these rankings in, um, in, uh, over the weekend. And I was able to save an hour and a half of time just by doing steps 1 through 10 without backlinks indexer and without SendWire. Um, so um, let's go over a couple of these keywords. So here's one right here, St. James City Roofing Companies. Uh, so here's my video right here, two days ago. You can see that I uploaded that two days ago. That's a picture of me. Now this video is not relevant at all. This has nothing to do with roofing. This is just a video that I made, just a quick video. And now that I know that I can rank for this keyword, I'm going to go and delete this video, and I'm going to go make a more professional video. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to do the the use vid penguin to get it back up there, and then I'm going to do a couple more things. I'm going to do the backlinks indexer and to help push it up higher. Okay, so that's one right there. Uh, let's see. I don't know if you're showing your screen. Oh, I'm so sorry. Thought I was. Uh, let's switch it over to me. My apologies for that. Uh, let's see. Why can't I show my oh, change presenter? Okay. Cool. All right. Uh, so y'all can see my screen now? Yes. Okay. So here's, here, is, here it is right here, St. James City Roofing Companies. Um, here's the video right here, two days ago, as you can see. And I'll blow this up so that you can see that that's me. That's me, Anthony Aries, right there. And this is, again, this video is not relevant. I'm going to go in, delete this video. Now that I know I can easily rank for this keyword. All I did was steps one through ten, um, which is, uh, let's see. Um, I don't think it's over here. I thought I had it in here. Um, could you send me steps one through? Actually, you, you gave it to me right here on this spreadsheet. Duh. Let me uh, let me get this for you really quick so that you can see what I'm talking about. Um, all right, so that's one. While that's loading up, that's one. Say file. Here, let me open this up so you can see you can see what I'm talking about. Okay, so. These are the steps that Damon talked about, right? Steps 1 through 12. I didn't even do step 11 and 12. I didn't create index uh, the backlinks, and I didn't bookmark or do the video embeds. I just did steps 1 through 10. If you add up steps 1 through 10, it's an hour and 15 minutes. So I'll just do a quick, a quick sum over here so that you can see how long it takes to do steps 1 through 10. So... Steps 1 through 10, 74 minutes. So that's about an hour and 15 minutes to do steps 1 through 10. So I was able to do this technique that I call, uh, or Damon and Gil actually coined it, keyword probing. And so what, uh, like I said, what I do is I just make a random video, boom, I get it to rank. And I, I just did steps 1 through 10 using uh, Vid Penguin. Boom, it ranked. So I know that that's a good keyword for me to go after. I can go build a better keyword and get that video up. Um, some of these did not rank, so we're going to go through them. So Sanibel Island Roofing Companies, so that one ranked. So there we are right there again, okay, two days ago. All right, and, it, and I actually did a whole bunch of case studies on this, and on these case studies I actually did this whole thing live. Like I, I, I recorded the whole thing. I actually deleted all of them. I'm going to go and delete all these videos uh, today. They're not even going to be available anymore. Uh, and you know you can see me doing this live. If you all would like those case studies as a, as a bonus, uh, I'm going to delete them. You'll never be able to see them again. There's so many secrets that I reveal in there, stuff that I haven't revealed to anyone. I can include those to you as a bonus. Um, and I'm not going to, if you're interested, let me know. Um, oh, the staying power is awesome, Rob. So check this out. Here's a video that I did in 2013. Remember at the beginning of the call... I told you that I discovered this method in 2013. All right, so check this out. Um, 
this was only with the five YouTube URLs. Remember I told you I only did it with five because I didn't know about the 22. This video has been on the first page of Google since 2013. Orlando Barber, that's a pretty competitive keyword. This guy gets a ton of calls because I did that. I also got him under best Orlando Barber too. And that's me in the video right there. Uploaded by Anthony Airy, so you can see that that's me. I'll move that out of the way. I also got him under best Orlando Barber. There we are right there. So it's very, very powerful. Very, very, very powerful. All right. Uh, let's look at another one. Captiva Roofing Company. Some of them I didn't rank for, right? Some of them I did not get on the first page. I think this was one of them. So I'm giving you full disclosure. What's the idea? Does everyone understand the concept of probing? So what we're doing is we're just blasting these videos out and seeing which ones rank. Not all of them are going to rank. Some of them are. Some of them aren't. Punta Hasa Roofing. Uh, here's another one I ranked for two days ago. There, is, there I am right there. Uh, Fort Myers Roofing Companies. Let's see how we did with that one. We did not make the first page of that one. Um, let's see. Did we make the second page? Nope. We did not make. So this is a tougher keyword, right? I made it to the third page. So what I would do in this case, right, I only did steps 1 through 10 that you saw on here. So what I would do in this case now is I would go back and do step 11. I would create index and URL backlinks, all variations. I would go do that step. I'd wait about 24 hours to see what would happen. And then I would go do step 12. And I would use VidPenguin to build the bookmarks through SendWire, do the video embeds through SendWire. And then I would see what would happen after that, okay? Um, all right, so that's that one. Um, let's take a look at Astero Island Roofing Companies. Oh, there I am right there. I'm even uh, above the local listing here that Google has two days ago. Uh, Gateway Roofing Companies. All right, so we're not on the first page for that one. Laura, you're definitely going to get those bonuses. You're good to go, girl. I'm After this call, if I have enough energy, I'm going to be working on getting all those bonuses together tonight. Uh, all right, so we're on the second page for this one, right? So what would we do for this one, right? This one we would go, and we would go do step 11, and then we would, and then we would wait a, a day, and then if it wasn't on the first page, we'd go and do step 12, all right? So uh, it's a super effective strategy, and it's like you could just sit here Make a, you know, make a video that's not relevant like I did, and then just, boom, use VidPenguin, use VidPenguin, just keep, that's all I did, I just blasted VidPenguin. Lori saw my videos, Lori that's on this call, she wants my bonuses, she saw me make these videos, she saw me do the whole thing live. So here we are on the first page for San Carlos Park Roofing. Uh, so now I know that these are easy keywords for me to go after. Uh, by the way, the, the channel that I'm doing this on is a brand new channel. This channel has no authority. Uh, it is not an old channel. It's a very new channel. So there's no authority. All right, so this one, I didn't make the first page on this one. Uh, Stereo Roofing Companies. Let's see if I made the second page. Nope, we didn't make the second page. Let's see the third page. This one's a tougher keyword, right? We didn't do the, you know, steps 1 through 10 weren't good enough, so we have to go back and do step 11 and 12. Is everybody getting what I'm, what I'm sharing here with you? Because I want to make sure you all understand how powerful this method is. This will save you so much time because you're, you're, you're not going to be wasting time on hard keywords. You can literally go at, right away, start to put up videos. I could put up a video for uh, a roofing a roofing company, and then I could sell the leads to a roofing company. You know, looking for a good roofing company? Call us here today, and we'll give you a free quote. And I could redirect those calls to a roofing company and sell those leads to a roofing company. I could rent that video to them. I can do all kinds of crazy stuff. Uh, Bonita Springs Roofing Companies. I think this, was, this one was a toughie. Um, I think we got on the... Th I, don't, I don't even know if we got on any of the first, second, or third page of this one. This one is a tough keyword. Let's see, three, yeah, we didn't even make the third page on this one. That happens, right? So now I know that Bonita Springs Roofing Companies is going to be too hard. I'm not going to waste my time on that one. I'm going to just keep moving. North Naples Roofing Companies. How did we do on this one? Let's see if we made page two. 
All right, we're on page two. So we go back and we do steps 11, wait a day, and then see if we end up on the first page, then we do step 12. All right? Um, let's see. Uh, Orange Tree Roofing Companies. Boom, there we are, first page. Um, Harlem Heights Roofing Companies. There we are, number one. All right, so pretty, pretty neat stuff, right? I think that was a pretty cool little bonus. Damon, to share that. Yeah, I'm sorry, I was muted. No, that's that's a great bonus to show. And the reason you're doing this, Anthony, I, I just want to make sure everybody's aware of, is you want to find the easiest low-hanging fruit to go out and talk to roofing companies. Yep. You don't want to mess around with with areas or locations that you're not going to easily rank. This is very low-hanging fruit. So right here, where you're ranked actually number one yep. for Harlem Heights Roofing Companies. Yep. I don't know how many are in Harlem Heights, but uh, it can't be more than four or five roofing companies. You just pick up the phone, call them, and say, "Hey, I got a video here. Uh, you could either sell it, you could uh, lease it, you could do a whole bunch of different things." But it it makes it real quick when that roofing company could just type in their city, the roofing company, and be able to look and see, hey, there's already a video there. All I have to do is pay them X number of dollars, and I'm right there. Yep. I guarantee you if these guys have watched this video, they're not going to be happy because this has nothing to do with roofing. <laughs> <laughs> and these guys are paying to be here. These guys are paying. These guys are paying. These guys are paying. And I'm here for free. I'm number one for free. So I'm going to go in and delete all these, actually. And now I know what keywords to go after and put up videos on there, right? I hope that makes sense, everyone. It's super powerful. I'll include all these case studies and the how to do all this stuff as a bonus if, if you're interested in it. Send your proof of purchase to my help desk. So it's uh, myproducthelpdesk.com. Laura, you're already getting it. You don't have to send me your proof of purchase. I know that you, you're good to go. Uh, myproducthelpdesk.com. And send me, and I, I just put that in the chat box. Just send that over. Um, we still have some spots left if you want to jump on. I'm going to put that, uh, I believe we're down to seven. Uh, Bid Penguin uh, 2G. And uh, if you want to come on board, now is the time. Lori uh, says she wants to know what steps 11 and 12 look like in Bid Penguin. Can I just turn it over to you really quick so you can show sure. her? Yeah, let me share my screen here. Okay. Okay, show my screen. Here we go. Let me bring that back up. Okay, uh, coming back over here. I can tell you the colors. Uh, step 11 is blue button. Step 12 is yellow button. Remember how we talked about backlinks indexer? And this is linking indexing, so all I have to do is hit submit. That's step 11. And this is step 12 where we go out and we do about four hours worth of work all by hitting this green button here. But what we're doing is we're sending it to campaigns, we're selecting whether it's a bookmark, a status update, or a video embed, and we're using SendWire. Now, it, do you have to have SendWire? No, you don't. There's IFTT, there's, you could hire five or gigs to do all this for you, which are five bucks. Uh, you could do it yourself, which is sometimes takes up to about four hours, and you could you can hire a lot of this out, but we've made it, if you bought SendWire, you can actually integrate it. It's real easy to integrate. And basically, you're, you choose that, that, your drip schedule, and hit send. And that's how easy it really is. It's awesome. I mean, like, I was doing all this stuff manually, folks, before these guys came along and, and built this. And I was paying for people to do it, too. So just think of the savings that you get. It's just unbelievable. And there's one thing I didn't show you here is uh, download feed as a CSV. If you do this, I'm going to open it with Microsoft Excel just to show you what it looks like. What you get when you download the CSV is remember the title and description, how we changed everything. Let me just do this auto fit column width. 
you get your URL, you get your title, and you get the description. Now, if it has an image in it, it's actually copied the image into your CSV file. So that's kind of neat right there is you have the actual image that you can do something with, like adding it to Flickr or Instagram or Pinterest, um, and it has the link back to the video itself. So there's, there's your description. So this is the CSV file that we create for you automatically, all by hitting that little green button. And if you want to ever clean up, you can just go in and delete your feed. I, there's no problem with, we store all the feeds that you want, so you can always come back to them. Uh, and let me show you here. I'm just going to kind of tease you a little bit. This is a, our mashup, and it's on beta. Meaning beta is, you might have some problems here. Uh, but I've, I've got a, a deal for my, one of my clients, and we're doing, he's a photographer, so we're doing a maternity photo photography. Okay. And what this does is it goes out to the web, and it looks for RSS feeds, and it ranks them by popularity based on, and to, add them together, let's say I want that one and I want that one, then I can come in and I can grab the video URL RSS feed, post it in there, and then I can hit external if I wanted to put some more RSS feeds, or I could come over and I could grab a, UR, a YouTube channel like we did earlier. Now I'm just going to grab this channel down here. I know this has nothing whatsoever to do with maternity, but I wanted to grab that and I'll post it in here. And it takes the channel and converts it into an RSS feed. And then you can do filters where you can actually filter through and say I only want maternity in the title or I want photography in the description. But now here's the preview of it. It's generating the preview down here. So this is what your RSS feed will look like. Now what it's done is it's blended my client's RSS feed in with other feeds. And this is really powerful because you want to be associated with some really high ranking, high page ranking sites. So uh, this is just an example, and I, I didn't do a lot of research into what feeds I'm pulling in there, but you just basically save it. Of course, you need a description. I'll just put in here photo, just as an example. But you would want to put in a really good feed title and a feed description. And then I hit save. And it saves this RSS mashup. Now, what can you do with the RSS feed? You can feed it back into Sendwire. You can go out to all types of pinging services. Or you can create another feed burner with all this combination. So this is kind of like hanging with the popular kids in high school. You can get your client's uh, video channel hanging around some really popular RSS feeds. Now, this is we're in beta, so right now you get... It's just included in there as, as a beta. Uh, at some point in time, we may upgrade it to a full-blown package. But uh, for right now, you, you can ping it, and you can uh, go in and do the mashup. Okay. Uh, let's take some questions, and then we'll wrap this thing up tonight. We don't want to keep everybody on all that long, but we've been on about an hour and ten minutes, and... If there's any questions that we can answer, just uh, go ahead and put them in the chat box. Okay. Looking like we've answered most of them. Yeah, it looks like most of the questions are good and answered. Okay. Okay. Uh, 
okay, I just want to point out one more time. Here's the spreadsheet link, and here's the link to the uh, to the automated VidPenguin service. And I'm, I'm going to show you real quick while we're on here. Uh, I'm going to hop over to Facebook just to show you and show you how active our group is. We've got about 665 members in there, but we got 70 new people in the last 24 hours. But you can see as you go through here, we are very active in Facebook. There's a lot of commenting going on. There's a lot of helping. People like to help out in this group as they get more and more knowledge is they'll start sharing things. We have pictures. Uh, I know we got some videos in here too. And we also have some cheat sheets available inside of our deal under files where we have a uh, step-by-step process for Sinwire Buddy, uh, power ranking strategy, uh, five best ranking video tools. Uh, so anyway, you can kind of see that we take care of our customers and we go from the manual method up to the full-blown method in about 60 seconds. And otherwise it would take you about to get to this part here, about an hour and 15 minutes to create this manually. So anyway, uh, I think we're going to end the webinar if we don't have any further questions. And I appreciate everybody attending and uh, hope that you join us with Fid Penguin. Thank you, everybody. And thank you, Cyril and Brad, for uh, having us. Bye. Thank you, Brad. Bye-bye.